Lambda expressions are a new uh, feature coming to Java 8. And this video is a quick introduction to Lambda expressions and an Oracle by example web tutorial or OBE on Lambda expressions. So I'm just going to show you um, a quick example and then hopefully you can take a look at the uh, OBE and dig in more if you're interested. So what I'm going to start with here is uh, we're going to sort a list of persons and here's the class that defines person we've got to give a given name a surname you know first and last name age gender various attributes there and we're gonna work off a list of those so let's look at our test class here I've called that comparator test I'm going to uh, scroll down here and the first thing we should see is um, our list there on line 14. And that's what we're going to work off of. And uh, to sort a list, one way you can do that in Java is with a comparator. And so that's done here. I'm going to highlight that. And um, this is calling the collections class and the sort method. Uh, so you see there we're passing in the person list. And then we're making an, an anonymous inner class um, out of a comparator out of the comparator interface uh, we got uh, you see it's of type person or we've got a compare method where we're passing in person objects and then in the body of the method you'll see we're returning uh, a comparison of the surname and so that should sort the list in ascending order so it's fairly easy to read but it's still not perfect there's a lot of brackets there a lot of parentheses it's pretty verbose for what we're doing we just want to say sort the list ascending and we do a lot of work to basically make that happen so let's scroll down further and see how we would do that with lambda expressions so with lambda expressions I can do the same thing here on line 30 and 31 so I'm highlighting that line and we can see here that I'm going to assign the lambda expression to a comparator interface instance like that. And notice that the syntax is um, kind of the same sort of thing but just a heck of a lot shorter. So I've got, I'm passing in persons again, P1, P2, and I'm also doing a compare to, we have the uh, arrow token there that indicates this is a lambda expression. And uh, I just give it the expression that I've basically accomplished the same thing I did up above with all that code. But this is going to do a descending sort. So I named the uh, instance, vari instance variable there sort surname descending. So if we go down here when we call our collections class and the sort method, you can see there that's quite a bit easier to read between the two. I think it uh, makes a lot more sense. And then let's see what happens when we run this class. So I'm going to just run it. And you can see here, down here in the output window, um, I've got a, a ascending list first and then a descending list second. So that's it. That's basically uh, how a Lambda expressions work, or that's a real simple example. So um, if you want a lot more information and a lot of examples and source code, please take a look at the OBE.